In the time before time, all was one and unchanging. Then, in a thunderous flash, Thus, were born the cycles. The spin of the earth, the passing of the seasons, birth and death, again and again. But life is compelled to transcend, and so man came to ascend. We grew and learned, raising countless civilizations, and reaching heights the likes of which today we can only dream. But the power that these civilizations achieved also brought with it the seeds of their downfall. Blown to dust, each in turn leaving nothing in their stead but the motion that would give rise to the next. Birth and death again and again. The Sahib, a civilization lost long ago to the dust, saw the coming of their own destruction, and though they could not prevent it, they sought to break the cycles. Nine among them were chosen, and shielded from death that they might serve as protectors of the Sahib legacy. Shepherds to a reborn humanity. But such matters are never simple. The cycles have endured, and so have the Unknown Nine continued their fight against them. And once again, the wheel is turning. Are the accommodations to your satisfaction? Come on, get out. Rika, let me... What were my exact instructions? Stay at the house. Now that sounds simple enough. Wouldn't you say, Haruna? I can help. Let me come. You won't regret this, please. 
If you were to accompany me, you must follow my instructions to the letter. Is that clear? Clear as daylight. So, where are we headed? I need to reach that distant oasis, but the desert has retaken the road. So we walk. It's like all the life here got scraped away by one big hand. Why would you possibly need to be here? All I know is that it's serious. It's more than serious. It is dangerous. Rekha, you've always been there for me. Let me be there for you. That's not what we are to each other, child. Won't you at least tell me what we're doing here? I am here for my own reasons. You are here because the desert would swallow you up too if I left you alone. Hmm. An old pupil of mine has become misguided. Looking where he shouldn't be. Vincent. Yes. Vincent. Rekha, we should go around. I won't say I told you so. There is always a path for those willing to find it. Come, we need to hurry. Rekha, who is Vincent? A talented young quester. Someone who I had hoped could be a guiding light. It turns out I was mistaken. You called him a pupil. Did I? No hidden nooks this time. When there isn't a path to be found... Make one. You'll need to teach me that trick someday. These are incredible. Who? They call themselves the Sahin. Though that name has long been lost to time. The Sahin? Like in your stories about the Unknown Nine? Like in my stories, yes. Does this have anything to do with why Vincent is here? One could say Vincent and the Sahin run parallel paths. Presents your deepest essence. It is a bridge between this world and the other. The form? Yes. Your shade draws Am directly from the form. Now try channeling that energy into the braces. I did it! Good. Mm -hmm. You're thinking about the braces? It's difficult to put into words. You'd expect it to feel like reaching out across the distance and crushing those stones. But it was like there was no distance to bridge, and the stones didn't feel separate. Separation is but an illusion, albeit a persistent one. Can you make it up that cliff? I spent my childhood scaling walls. Can you? Of course. There's plenty you don't know about me. Our destination lies beyond that large rock formation. What do you intend to do when you catch up to Vincent? And that depends entirely upon Vincent. <sighs> we need to drop onto that ledge. That's a good drop. Can you make it? Do I seem that old to you? Mm, not old, just older. You're the oldest person I know. Perhaps I am. Even so, you should get out and know more people. Come. <clears throat> Haruna, stay low. Who are they? They used to be part of a group of free thinkers and explorers. You mean the Lipia Society? Once. Perhaps. Now they simply follow Vincent. Watch your step. They're dangerous. do we have here? Are you all right, child? I've been better. Hold him back. I will 
I'll find my way down to you. Shouldn't have come here, Quester! You're dead! <laughs> Now, however would you grow if I did that? I see Vincent's men are... Taking a nap. Don't be complacent. These aren't bullies from your childhood. They may dress differently, but they certainly fold the same. Besides, we have a distinct advantage over them. These men might not share our connection to the fold, but they outnumber us by a wide margin. And our talents can be emulated. Emulated? Mimicked by devices. You will find our foes are far from helpless. We don't have time, child. What did you mean earlier when you said Vincent and the Sahin run parallel paths? They're bound for where hubris always leads people. They're led by self-righteousness. I can think of worse traits. Can you now? In my experience, the greatest harm often comes from the best intentions. What is that? An incoming storm. We must hurry. We can use that poor grass to stay out of sight. Ardeling, you're in. When there isn't a path, where's the damn trap? Is anyone out there? No, Vic here. We've lost contact with Ardeling's group. The storm might be interfering with the signal. Request you backtrack and establish. Don't rush in. On it. Wait for the suspicion to pass. Sometimes, all you need is a nudge. Focus on your shade. Channel your energy into the braces like you have learned. Then, visualize your opponent and unleash that energy. is impressive lately, Aruna. Let's go, child. Make sure those beacons are in place. Be mindful of your surroundings, Aruna. 
hidden perils and how to recognize the opportunities that surround you. Leverage them to your advantage. Hey, stop it! You afraid to face me? useful. They sound close, but I can't see them. Deal with him discreetly. Hampers pass to your mind. Focus inward and peek into the fold. What is it really? It has been called many things. The spirit realm. The Don't divine sphere. The inner world. Some believe it stores time's That's endless possibilities. But no one, not even the Sahin, could more than guess at its Damn. true nature. Send out a general recall. Search might be a bust. What are we looking for anyway? As soon as the quester shows their face. That's the sound of a hiding quester. Anyone inside? Afraid. Not really. Slippery.
Abel! I swear, if you're asleep somewhere... Can you handle those two? Be mindful of your surroundings. I think I've got it. Something's not right here. I've got her! Exploding canisters weren't exactly subtle. We should expect trouble. Hands up. Quickly, girl. How many more? It's just the two of us. We're lost. Looking for shelter from the incoming swarm. Yeah, and I'm just... <laughs> Hold. Stay still, who days long. As you can. It will keep you human. It is no small thing to grip the reins of another's shade, but there are times where it's necessary. The people you step into, what happens to them? Their shade is temporarily pushed out into the fold. But just temporarily, right? Rekka? Has anyone not been able to return to their body? It depends on the skill of the stepper. A shade who loses the tether to their body becomes lost, becomes a rifter. The fold is lettered with them. Rifters? Are they dangerous? The longer a rifter remains in the fold, the more it loses touch with the human it once was. In the end, the only thing that remains is a blind desire to find a host body. That's a truly terrible fate. I wouldn't wish that on anybody. Then be mindful, child. Watch your step. As it were, and leave space for a shade to return. Rekha, what is that? A fold anomaly. Anomalies are pockets of knowledge trapped in the surface fold. They can be used to learn new skills. You will find them essential in your evolution as a quester.
Rekha, something strange just happened. I know, child. This world is deeper than you thought. Fear not. I know that you'll grow within it. They found the Oculus. What does that mean? All those small dig sites we came across. Vincent is searching for something, unsure where to dig. That large camp near the storm's edge tells me he's found it. Rekha, there's no way we can reach that camp before the sandstorm. Then the storm shall be our ally. <laughs> Hurry, child. <laughs> we won't have enough time to evacuate. Leave it. Just to make sure you load Who is those that? Plates. Vincent's right hand. Mila, I am not about to risk my men's lives for some damned relics. Those relics could lead to Matos's next great innovation. So you can either load them up, or stay here and be buried with them. We'll have the crates packed into the truck within the hour. I know you will. We need to find a way around that fence. Or through it. Good thinking. Perhaps you could persuade that man to help us. I will teach you how to step. Find your target. Realize the space that separates you is but illusion. Now focus, and bridge the gap. And so now you find its true danger. Never forget the risk, the cost, Aruna. Becca? The braces. They indicate the presence of a nearby scribing. A scribing? Bottles in a sea of armor, left behind by past questers for the benefit of future generations. I will show you how to find it. I'll try peeking into the fold. small specks of am flowing follow them they will lead you to the scribing Scribings come in two kinds. The first kind is represented by the Sahin symbol for the three bodies. They allow one to draw more am from the fold. The second symbolizes the tree of life. They increase one's life force. Aruna, you need to peek into the fold to find the scribing.
remember stepping. Use it to gain the upper hand. Any luck so far? strange about this piece, like a glint of the corner of my eye, or a faint echo. Do you hear that? Echoes, vibrations from a distant past, recorded into the stone by the fold, like sound on a wax cylinder. As your connection to the fold grows stronger, you will become more sensitive to them. Follow these doctrines. they doing here digging up the past and meddling with concepts that are beyond their comprehension i doubt we can stay hidden for much longer remember to leverage the lessons i've taught you i won't let you down Rekka. the sandstorm is getting worse focus huruna we'll be all right
sight. Let's go, child. to find some cover. It's a good thing you were there to guide me. Yes. Though some things we must do without guidance. Hey, I've done plenty of life on my own. I know this, child, of course. But life sends your compass spinning many times. You must be able to find what realigns it. That's easy. My compass points to you. <laughs> We don't have time, child. 